the famous Gary Peak from Peak Robotics. This stuff's gonna revolutionize horticulture through electrification. Can you take me through and just explain really quickly what, uh, what these machines are and what you envisage for the future? Fully electric, a couple of big electric batteries on the sides that can just be pulled off, new ones put on, out again. So we can work 24 by seven, Yep. no sitting on charges, electric wheel motors, massive pulling power, same machine with a mower on it. We yep. started off with a tow behind mower. Right. But that was terrible because it you Efficiency could stop and jackknifing or things like that. Where here, for the front mounted one, we can put 150 kg carried on the back of here. Yep. So we can put the same batteries the robot's got on it on here. Then we've got a triple deck mower that will fold up, fit in the van. It's How long is this set up to get the geo fencing or the, the programming done on an orchard? Uh, that's pretty quick. We yep. can either just serve, we can take lens maps, do the high precision GPS off lens, or we can establish our own base station. Sometimes we use the van as a base station, yep. or we just set one up. This is the same machine, but yep. it's got a 60 litre spray tank on it, breakaway spray bar for spraying under tree. We have a camera rig that actually fits on the front, and we've trained it to recognise broadleaf weeds. We can drive this around and just spot spray the weeds. We've spent four years developing these. We went through, this is our generation four robot. Yep. That's now ready for commercialization. You know, this is the obvious future. Really. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah. Thank you very much for your time.